new vlog. You've caught me mid taking a break from Billie Eilish's new album so I can actually speak to you. And also mid packing chaos. I go to Saint-Tropez tomorrow morning. I leave bright and early. I still have not packed. I am not ready. The most I've done is wash my hair, hence the the beautiful situation here where I'm trying to train my baby hairs to lie flat because they they will not. I have not tanned. I've actually spent a week scrubbing. Scrub and I never have to scrub myself but I did two very thick layers of tan for my hen and it's taken me since when was the last time i applied the tan like the saturday before what was that like mid mid may we're in june now and i still am like i think i'm there i think i'm like tan free now i also am so overdue doing my nails but i just don't think we're gonna have time to do an infill today so i'm going to saint tropez with my crazy ibiza hen nails and i'm slightly embarrassed about this but I just don't even have time to file the orange off and just leave my bio. There's like the nice little pink underneath on. I genuinely, maybe I'll have time at like, I don't know. I just wanna be in bed early, you know? You know when you've got like a flight that you have to be up so early for? The car pickup is early, so I need to be up even earlier. I like to actually be up like a good hour before my car pickup arrives. So anyway, it's a busy day. We've got a lot to get on with. We've got a lot to pack. And classic me, I have left it until the last dying second to pack. But in all fairness, I was prepping for the, my jewelry edit launch at the week weekend and before that I don't remember what I was doing but I was busy and before that was on my hen so it's just all systems go at the moment. This is my outfit of the day. I'm wearing my brown Adenola set which went missing for a long time and I've been really missing this and then we actually found it in Ryan's wardrobe. I'm not sure what's going on there. I was like why is my stuff in your wardrobe but whatever I'm glad to be reunited with it because this is one of my all-time favorite sets from them ever 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 i have the brown top on underneath which i'm probably gonna have to like take this off and switch to in a minute because it's roasting up here in the wardrobe room i also have a necklace on which is from my aurelia edit it feels so good to be able to say that because i have literally been gatekeeping this for what feels like an eternity yeah you can shop this now it's part of my edit if you didn't watch the last vlog you can go and watch that and see the full edit if you want i take you through all of the pieces and yeah thank you so much for all of the love and support on that vlog because i was so nervous and it i don't know it's just such a nice good feeling I loved it. I love all of you. Thank you so much. I haven't done a jewellery collection in years so yeah I was very nervous but I'm glad you're all loving it so much. I actually have a lot of the pieces ready to go in my suitcase. As you can see I've just been throwing things at my suitcase. And over here we also have a ton of things ready for me to try on to decide what I'm going to be taking with me. I'm so excited. This video by the way is going to contain a paid for integrated partnership with Adenola which I'm so happy about. And I also have beauty bits because guess what has just arrived? I was screaming. This is so cool. I've got the Barrier Restore Cream. Also, yes, I'm aware this vlog is probably giving chaotic energy already, but that is just where I'm at in life right now. Barrier Restore Cream. Really excited to try all of this. I, as you know, my skin is temperamental, so I've been really excited to put this to the test because it gives me, like, nourishing, like, good for sensitive skin kind of vibes, but we, we shall see. Then we've got the glazing milk i love the packaging and then we have the pineapple refresh daily cleanser i am a fussy girl with cleansers so i will put this to the test i will report back oh and we also have the peptide glazing fluid this is what i think i see all over social media so excited to try this it's giving me gentle vibes i need to, i need to stop speaking like a tiktok all the time it's giving me the impression that it's very gentle use your words susie right the other day I was like what are you gonna do when tiktok isn't a thing anymore and you're still like it's giving summer <laughs> But on that note, look at my sw oh, I'm so shiny. It's giving summer. I need powder. Okay, so back to packing. I have two daytime outfits, two evening outfits, and then I just need sports and swim. I love when you get an itinerary in advance of a trip. It just makes packing so easy. So I think we've got some kind of tennis, but not tennis lessons. I'm not sure. I don't know. And then there's a boat trip. So yeah, we're going to need some kind of like swim, but also like cover up kind of outfits and then i also need an outfit to travel in that is comfortable so i think we're gonna delve into the adenola order all right over you come giant box oh also not my jewelry packing this is probably the least aesthetic hello <laughs> the least luxurious way to pack jewelry but yes i know i'll stroke you in a second <laughs> but i like it this way because i find my stuff gets tangled less it gets scratched less and i also have kept like old packaging and i put my sets my stacks of earrings onto this so that they're all like together so yeah that is how 
I am packing the jewelry at the moment. This works really well for necklaces. I'm very into this way of packaging. My necklaces don't get tangled. Also, I know I have just launched a jewelry edit, but I couldn't not give a mention to the lovely Amy from Old Muse who has just done a collab with Heather Mayhem. Look at these, they're insane. Anyway, this is actually the first time that I'm like, oh, it's actually really hard having your own jewelry collection to promote and then also just loving everyone else's jewelry all at the same time. Like just because I have an edit doesn't mean like other edits don't exist and other collabs don't exist and they're not good. And I'm just like, oh my God, I wanna talk about everything. Like, but yeah, I'm a big, big fan of the Old Muse collab. Anyway, okay. So I think I'm just gonna get all of this out and we can just try it all on together rather than me sit and like show you every single item i love doing it that way but i'm just a bit worried that because we obviously have like a full week together this week that we might just end up having the world's longest vlog oh my god oh, that's so cool i am going to unpackage this all and then we'll just do one big try on together <laughs> a fresh pair of black leggings I'm so happy. These are the best leggings. If I'm ever wearing a pair of black leggings and you want to know what they are, it's always this. Oh my gosh, okay. You guys, I'm obsessed with these trousers. These are like the other linen ones that I have from a different retailer over the past couple of years, except they're like, I think they're a bit thicker and they also don't have like, they have the waistband, but my other ones seem to like go out a bit and they really like exaggerate my hips. These are way more slimming. Yeah love i'm annoyed that i didn't buy these sooner <laughs> i have them in black as well and i love them i don't know why i slept on the white i guess because i had a different pair that were really similar i didn't want to double up but my old pair are so gross now and very well worn and loved but these are so much better oh my god yeah love love i think this is going to be amazing with a bikini i've actually ordered some swim from adenola hopefully it's going to arrive today fingers crossed i think this would be amazing on the boat and i also have i think the matching shirt to this i have a cotton shirt in the exact same color from adenola so i think that would be such a good boat look yeah i am really happy with these we all need these we all need a pair of these anyway i have also got this gorgeous ribbed gray t-shirt on this is i have this in long sleeve i don't know if you remember i have the gray set with the fold over trousers and i wear the long sleeve version of this like day to day so much around the house it's such a go-to for me so this is like my summer version which i can wear with the fold over trousers but it also just works so nicely with these cotton trousers and i really like the fact that it's quite long i don't know if you can see like it goes really far down so i don't have to worry about it like untucking itself and then like getting it's almost like a body but without the faff when you have to pee so i love that very happy with these two items we are off to a good start i have half of my boat look already fingers crossed the swim arrives if it arrives really late tonight you'll see it on the trip hopefully but yeah i ordered the cutest yellow bikini i'm really hoping that i get to wear it because that'll be so fun so yeah this yellow bikini shirt the boat look is done we love that and also i could travel home in this if i wanted to this is also a nice travel outfit if you're going away just just buy this i also have this sweatshirt that i ordered from them and the tones match really well so i could throw this in my bag for the boat day as well just in case i get really chilly <gasps> i love this is so cozy i think the shorts are out of stock in my size which is really annoying but i want them so badly because that would be such a cute little set together this is called marshmallow white adorable yeah i love their sweatshirts i love the fit of them they just sit so nicely like they get better as you wear them as well so cozy literally these are the only sweatshirts that i bother with i love the quality of them i love that they're not fleece lined on the inside as well they're like the raw cotton it just makes it so much less faffy and i find they wash so much better like oh my god i just love this i'm so cozy right now to go with the trousers i also have this adorable yellow top i love it so much this yellow color there that they are currently doing is just so cute it's such a lovely buttery sunshine gorgeous yellow like it's not too bright at all like it's really not it's not a bright yellow to look at it's almost like a neutral yellow it's the perfect tone it's so nice i feel like it works really well with like my hair color and the fact that i'm not tanned and wearing yellow and i feel very like confident in it they have slayed such a nice look i also have a yellow sweatshirt too no i'm not okay for how cute this is i love this so much this is so sweet i need the matching shorts to this like immediately they need to come back into stock pronto i will be refreshing the website every day for the foreseeable trying to get my hands on the yellow shorts because this would be so cute to play tennis in i actually i could wear this and then have my white tennis skirt from adenola 
that would be really sweet. That's the potential. I'm honestly very likely to overthink my tennis outfit until I leave tomorrow morning, like from now until I leave. But yeah, that would be really, really cute. I'm obsessed. I rest my case, Your Honor. <laughs> Okay, this is a great one. This has good airport potential because I already own the leggings to match this top. This is why I love when Adenola just like bring the same colors. They have their core colors and they bring them out over and over again because I'm like, I already own the leggings for this. Great, we can get the matching top. Love that. And then I've got a new pair of little gray shorts. I don't have a pair of their shorts in gray and I literally live and breathe in their like shorts and sweatshirt sets during the summer. With our unpredictable weather, you just can't go wrong. The sweatshirt and shorts are just my go-to. Like shorts, a tank, the sweatshirt can come on and off. As it gets warmer or colder, you are good. And this also works very well for the airport because I can rock up to the airport in my leggings and my top. And then as we depart the plane, I can change my shorts. So yeah, this definitely has good airport potential. I'm in love with this top. I feel like this cut is just so nice and flattering and with the high neckline as well i really love it and i am going to literally live in these shorts all summer long i'm obsessed with them also i believe i get all of the shorts in an extra small because i find they come up quite oversized and then i think pretty much the majority of my tops and leggings are a size small i will confirm everything in the info box for you guys but i find the sizing really consistent so i tend to get like the same thing in certain items every single time my sweatshirts the majority of the time are normally an extra small shorts are an extra small and then in the more fitted items i go for the small but in all fairness i have friends that are my size that buy the extra smalls and they find them really comfy everything has so much stretch but i just you know when you just don't want something to be too tight that you spend a lot of time walking and sweating in and i'm a bloaty girl you know like i don't know i walk i walk a lot it's not for me the leggings have gone on i have had this on my wish list for so long these jackets give me real like pilates mum energy and i'm so here for it so it's like a zip up sweatshirt no hood or anything like that which i love because i find i'm not a big hoodie girl i have to really love a hoodie to rock a hoodie i much prefer sweatshirts things that don't have anything faffy around the neck and these oh my god i love this it's got the adenola logo and it's in like a khaki green and i thought these would be perfect paired with this Ooh. this is maybe not airport me this is probably more gym me if i'm very honest because i'm going on a work trip tomorrow so i'm going to try and look a little bit more like i'm trying to slay a bit but this has gym me written all over it this is my perfect item for the gym because there's no faffing around with like i have my big headphones on a lot and to take a sweatshirt off when you've got your giant headphones on is really annoying but sometimes when you get in the gym the aircon is freezing and I don't want to like treadmill like literally with my arms out so this is so perfect I'm actually kind of shocked that I haven't got something like this sooner for the gym I actually have another one of this in a different color in this order but yeah I'm obsessed with the fact that there are the leggings that match so well with it and this color gray is so lovely as well it's like such a light tone of gray I find it very flattering yeah I'm just obsessed with it she's a Pilates mom now also not being funny but I'm so obsessed with this combo I think this might be airport vibes for tomorrow potentially I love it big big fan of this top I have the regular sports bra and these leggings obviously and I very rarely gravitate towards them as a set but this as a set I can get on board with okay we may have the airport outfit sorted this is the marshmallow white sweatshirt which has a matching logo to the leggings and the top and then I've also got on my little sledders I might swap it out for a trainer if I'm really honest but yeah I think this is this is a good airport outfit vibe oh hey fresh black leggings and then we have a new top oh, so this I don't know if you'll be able to see because it's black and my camera doesn't really like it when clothes are black but this is like a zip up short sleeved high neck top and I find these so flattering I got gifted one from a brand a couple of years ago and it's like in a it's a kind of weird material it's gray and black and I just always feel a little bit like not cool when I wear it but I love the fit of it it's so flattering and it gives real like Pilates mum vibes I love that but I just don't love the actual top itself and like the design of it I just really wanted something in plain black and Adenola have come to my rescue so they have the short sleeve version which I really like I think it's actually very flattering I always worry a bit with like a 
short sleeve but i also have it in long sleeve as well yeah it's so nice it's so well fitting so good perfect okay great if anyone sees me hot girl walking this is gonna be my go-to outfit i am obsessed i also have my adenola puffer which i wear over the top of all of this stuff as well literally like a walking advert 24 7 but this is how much i love this stuff i do you know what this <laughs> is my my ideal everyday outfit <laughs> If I could wear one outfit for the rest of my life, I actually think it would be this. It snatches you, my arms are covered, it's got little loopholes on the thumbs if you love that kind of thing. Oh, it's just so perfect and it goes perfectly with the leggings. Thank you, Adenola. And finally, we are peak hot girl walk attire right now. <laughs> I love this. I zipped it up and I was like... So this isn't zip up the whole way like the grey sweatshirt, but the zip does go low enough that it makes it so easy to take this off when you've got like headphones on or whatever. Also, I love this if I am like doing my makeup but then I need to change and I don't want to like touch the face. I just find tops like this very, very practical but also it just looks so nice and like it's cosy and I look like, I look comfy cosy but because it's black and it's just like fits really nicely, it's got that perfect slouch to it. I like still feel really good in it oh yeah i love this this is so soft as well so this isn't like their other sweatshirt material this is more of like their soft brushed cotton it feels like heaven this one and the yellow one are fleecy on the inside as well so bear that in mind it's not really a big deal i just wouldn't wear a lighter color underneath for the first couple of like wears of it i'm so happy with this i know this is slightly unseasonal but our summers are just wild right now and i am fully committed to the hot girl walk life like every single day right now every single day i will be hot girl walking so i need to be prepared yeah and this is just great i've been going to the gym so much more as well and like i said the aircon is cold i love this would highly recommend oh my god i'm so comfy i'm never gonna take this off quick little matcha break this is so satisfying i don't know why <laughs> Guys, magical timing. <laughs> the swim has arrived. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I've been so excited for the yellow. I was praying it would arrive in time. Got khaki green. Oh, this is going to be so good. And then, of course, we have the classic black. These look so good. Right, are we seeing the vision? Please ignore the fact that my boobs are a different colour to the rest of my body. I'm obsessed. I love the yellow. I don't know if I've had a full yellow bikini before, but I'm not mad about it. I really like it. I think this is like a really nice, easy boat outfit. So yeah, I think I might go with this. Although I am intrigued by the olive green set. So let's give that a go. I really like the fit of these. I have a lot of bikinis in this kind of style, but number one, this color is insane. Number two, they fit really well, but the quality feels so good. Like this kind of material, what is this? Like scuba material. I have a lot from cheaper brands and this is just, I can tell the difference in terms of like getting what you pay for it's way thicker than the other ones i have because i have my other ones that are like textured and they have like the gold bits and they're amazing but i have like my more like plain material ones and they just don't they don't feel like this this is so nice very happy with these i got them in a size small i'm actually happy with that decision i wasn't sure at the time i was like oh i don't know how these are gonna fit i would say the sizing is like true to size slash borderline like generous especially like the yellow one i could have got an extra small and been very happy with it but i'm glad i've gone for the small because i'm at the point in the month now where my boobs are enormous and they still fit really really well but yeah if you're between sizes you don't need to go like upper size if that makes sense like the sizing is true to size slash generous so i'm very happy with that love that and this is the black i can confirm fit and quality it's the same if you're looking for a black bikini and you don't want to go like cheap cheap ones and you want one that's like good quality i would highly highly recommend this yeah they're so good I am refusing to take my sunglasses off right now because your girl looks like she has not had enough sleep and that is because that is the case. Wearing my little green set. It went down a treat at the airport. I'm very comfortable. I love it. Like I, the more I wear it, the more I'm like, okay, this is what I'm going to live in every day. I normally wear my black set every day. I'm going to be wearing this every day for the foreseeable. I love the cut. It's very flattering. So yeah, very happy girl. But anyway, we have arrived in Saint-Tropez. I don't know if you can see the view, but it is sensation. It's gorgeous weather. 
like we have been so lucky it was a bit cloudy when we touched down but we've arrived and it is beautiful i think we're about to have some pool time i'm just gonna like refresh the face a little bit because i'm feeling a bit parched my lips are dry as hell today but yeah i've checked into the room there's so much cute stuff on the bed i'm really excited to look at all of it i'm so excited this is the best thing when your skin is parched and you come away with a skincare brand and you're like i know that my dehydrated skin is gonna get the tlc it deserves and needs on the other end so this is all good yeah like there's so many things i have never seen before so smooth and glow oil elixir i wonder if they're scented they look like they'd be scented oh my god that's so nice shower gel oh yes i love there's one thing i love to be gifted it's shower gel lotion i bet that's gonna be amazing <gasps> Oh my god we've got the vino clean cleanser makeup removing cleansing oil that is a little bit of me and oh my god i have wanted to try this forever this is the grape water <gasps> yes yes sorbet cream moisturizer oh, yes vino perfect love such a great product then we have obviously my things which are already unpacked got a cute little shower situ in here such a sweet villa like this is my room and it has its own like access which is cool i've got my own balcony oh that view is amazing wow this is the bed setup i love this so fun so yeah this is what we've got on the bed so we've got the vino perfect invisible high protection spray high protection lightweight cream high protection cream oh my god i'm so excited to try this this is the spf stick and then we have the vino sun oh my god that looks are not real like these are gonna be right up my street i mean all sun cream is up my street but these are exactly what i need like i love a lightweight spf and then i always need a stick especially for my tattoos it's such a good thing to have and then we've got loads of little gifty bits oh my god we've got phone chains yes that is so cute it's like a little pink case <gasps> yes oh stunning got bits in here oh my god is that a bikini oh that's so sweet little orange gingham i don't know what this is let's see Ooh. Oh, 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 is, is this a top? Oh my God, that's so cute. Adorable. Oh my God, is there shorts? Oh my God, there's shorts. Oh, that is the cutest set I have ever seen. Oh my God. We have a fan. I love a fan. We have hair accessories. I love hair accessories. Oh my God, this packaging is so sweet. This looks so ah, Little quartz hair clip. Yes. Oh my God, yeah exactly what i needed i actually couldn't find mine this morning and we have some jewelry i think Ooh. oh my god those are incredible oh that's so beautiful i love that i am going to put on some sun cream sort my face out and i will be back with you oh my god i just noticed they have slippers this is literally so cute they have thought of everything oh, unreal i'm so comfortable yes it is just me by the pool Vic is in her room here. She's getting ready because she wants to do a full fresh face. I do not care for the full fresh face. I will work. I will work with what we have. And lots of the other girlies are still getting checked in. So I have got so much time to sit in the sun. This is unreal. So this is a huge villa. My room is actually just here. It's so beautiful. I've got a little bar over here. This is the life. Right, guys, we have got 45 minutes until we need to be at pre-dinner drinks. So I need to do a very quick glam. I've just curled my hair. I did do the heatless curls, but it's been so much warmer, both in the UK, it's been really humid. And then it's very warm here, so the curls have kind of dropped a bit. And I did want more of a bouncy curl, so I've put in some actual DHD waves. This is my favorite favorite color and then i'll heatless curl it tonight and i think they will just hold for the rest of the trip i feel like i'm all eyebrows right now i cannot wait to get glam on <laughs> you know sometimes you just do them a bit too bold for the rest of the face so let's get started shall we i'm just gonna go for a really nice neutral glam like brown in the socket i've gone for a nice like all over wash of very neutral vanilla color all over the eyelids just nice and easy for this evening. I'm having like a small bout of anxiety as well. Like she's really reared her head recently. 
she has i was feeling it like really badly last night i think do you know what i think it's just all the excitement that i've had recently like there's been so much going on it's been so much fun but there's just been a lot of stuff going on so i think i'm maybe just a bit overwhelmed and i need to catch my breath a little bit once i am home yeah but it's all just been so much fun recently i think maybe just too much fun it hasn't been like this for a very long time since like pre covid I feel a bit homesick i never ever normally feel homesick so this is a, it's not even like a concerning anxiety because i'm just like <laughs> oh it's been a while but it's nice because i don't feel like I, I like i know what it is and i'm just like oh it's that wow it hasn't been this way in a while and i'm like just not panicking but yeah i am feeling a bit funky so if i'm not like my usual chatty self i think like you can tell the difference between today and yesterday like we are very different vibes i'm gonna go in with a brown liner i just want to start soft and see how much i want to apply okay yeah we're just gonna we're gonna roll with this me and dick are the only people from the uk here which is so fun i feel very honored and also i think it's the first time me and dick have ever been on a trip together solo it's really cute also i have to say i refreshed my face with this before i redid my makeup after i got off the flight earlier like when we when you saw me earlier and i was like i'm gonna judge I used this and my face immediately perked up. So good, like I looked so dry before and I sprayed it on, I instantly looked better and then I was expecting that to dry off and then to just look a bit meh again. And I, it didn't, like I've just kind of kept the glow. It's really nice. Oh, eye makeup is just such a wonderful thing, isn't it? Like I felt like I was wearing absolutely no makeup and literally a little bit of eyeshadow, liner and mascara and I feel like a whole new woman. Here we have. Armani 102. This is my current favourite colour. It kind of looks a bit weird when it goes on at first. It, like, I always put it on, I'm like, oh, it looks great. And then it, like, sits for a second and then it's perfect. Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. This, I actually have realised recently, if I don't use this, there are certain mascaras I have that will transfer when it's hot onto my brow bone. If I use this, there is not a mascara that does it. And I only realised on a couple of days where I forgot to do it. Yet another reason why I am obsessed with this setting spray. I mean, look how much I'm, I've gone through so much. Okay. I think we're good. Let's get dressed. Oh my God, I love these shoes. They're so cute. Oh my God, this is my outfit of the evening. I feel like some of you will, well, most of you will probably have seen this already, but this is the same. Actually, did I show you this in my pen vlog? This is the same obvious dress that I was wearing. I've had it altered though. If you watched the last vlog, you would have seen. I'm so happy with it now. My boobs actually fill it before it was like gaping here. And then I have the same chili shoes that i wore on my hand and the same spicy margarita bag it's such a like for me i feel so outrageous in this outfit it feels really like almost like kind of silly but i love it at the same time i just love the chilies i love the nogs like it's my favorite things chilies tequila a bit of lime i think it's such a cute outfit and the theme for tonight is like sunset vibes and i did check and red was fine so i'm really excited to be wearing this and i didn't have to like get anything new for sunset vibes so that's amazing i almost forgot to do my jewelry so i'm wearing my overlapping shell drop earrings from aurelia i'm also wearing the starfish necklace from my edit and then i have the chunky ring the t-bar bracelet and yeah that is it i can't remember if i've said but the ring is sold out at the moment along with the statement shells but they are on pre-order so they will be coming back i hope that no one's too disappointed with that but at least it's pre-order i'm really happy that it's been made available for pre-order because it won't be that long i think the team are working at bringing it forward by a week as it is so hopefully even if you are pre-ordering it will be with you really soon but yeah i will leave links to the rest of the edit in the info box if you haven't already seen it yeah thank you so much for all of the love on that i'm literally i'm so happy i feel like i've probably said that already at the start of this vlog and i don't want to repeat myself too much but long trek to dinner that's my room this is dinner <laughs> this is the best commute ever 
Oh my gosh. Oh. Yeah, I literally just said Victoria is going to be a happy girl. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. You just see the funniest TikTok. The things we do, and Amelia's not even here. That's something Amelia would have made us do, and we would have been like, Amelia. Do you know what? There's a weird history of Vic showing her strength. Her extreme, incredible strength. Physical strength, not like, mental. The first time we ever did a TikTok like this, I was like, no, it's going to have to be me. Like, you're so dinky. I was like, no, 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 it's going to be me. Vic did it seamlessly. And I don't know how I ever did it. No, I honestly it don't. It was just like the strength of I'll put what we're talking about on screen. We've just upped that. Yeah, we have. We've upped the game by 10. It's so funny, this TikTok. Like, and everyone watched us. I wish we got footage of everyone watching us. And everyone just like, what? On this TikTok. Oh my God. This dinner, it looks wow. so good. <laughs> wow. got both my cameras <laughs> but i just did a little treadmill workout it was so nice oh the gym here has the most incredible view look at these flowers the color is just stunning we've even got little quarterly towels and i just noticed out on the terrace there's just breakfast ready in case you want it like how incredible is this like seriously look oh my god <laughs> This is so cute, you guys. Wow. Oh my god, this is so good! I'm looking for my sugar daddy with a boat. Is the mini bread yeah. sweet? Anything mini, anything mini is so good. Whoa. What I eat on this trip, none of your business. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Her phone's died. <laughs> I was like, oh no, her phone's died. What's she gonna do? She gets the vlogging camera out. <laughs> and I was enough of the vlogging camera, so now I'm like, okay. Like, what can I do? <laughs> now we've come over to a non yeah. scene. <laughs> She's back. <laughs> Honestly, Vic, stop trying to sunbathe, is one of the funniest <laughs> things on this planet. She goes, okay, who are you tapping the fan earlier while she was sunbathing? I was like, I was waiting. Actually. I was waiting for you to say to me, would you calm down? I was just like, you know when you get to a point, I'm so used to you, I'm like, oh, wow, she really just can't sit still. And I'm like laughing in my head, but I'm like, no, I can't keep, <laughs> I can't keep voicing <laughs> But it's so funny. Will Victoria lose her mind? <laughs> Stay <laughs> tuned. <laughs> I might. I'm not sure which one, but one of us might end up overboard. <laughs> oh, I never noticed that sign. That's so cute. Back at the villa after boat day. I'm gonna go the long route. I didn't give you guys a tour. So, the living room and breakfast is up there. Victoria's room is here. It's honestly, it's gorgeous. It's like a maze. It just keeps on going and there's all these rooms. A little fountain. This, I'm obsessed with. Look at all of these flowers. There's actually a lot of different ones like in there, it's so cool. And then you walk around here, and there's more rooms up here. And then my room is just this little one down here. And this is where it like loops around. And this is the pool, it's so cool. And then there's a little garden down here with all the quarterly cushions. They had yoga here this morning. This is a bit of a death trap at night. I had to walk down barefoot last night. <laughs> There's no mirror in my hotel room, so. <laughs> oh, I love it! Oh, I'm stuck! I'm stuck! Oh my god! Beautiful dress! Oh my god, I love you! Thank you, Beautiful. I'm stuck! I was stuck in the plank! Everyone in this restaurant just stared at me doing well. Yeah. <laughs> I'm wearing the Magda Victron dress. 
It's so pretty, Jimmy babe. Heels. Vic picked my shoes. <laughs> I did. She was going to go for flat shoes. Absolutely not. No, these are these are amazing, babe. Amazing. Doesn't she look like an angel? <laughs> this is Vic's outfit of the evening. Go over to her vlog for details, but she looks like an angel. <laughs> this restaurant is amazing. It looks so pretty. I love your hair slicked back. I really like it. This was more a necessity than a choice. This, yeah. But, um, also, I've lost my dry shampoo. So I was oh, like, you should I'll have just... come and ask me. I know, when I was thinking that, but I didn't have much time. So I just slicked it back. Do you, do you like my new earrings? They're really gorgeous. Sure. Too spicy margarita? Oh, yes, yes. yes. Mel is on it. Mel is like, do you want a spicy margarita? I'm like, yes. <laughs> You're not going to believe what's happened. I am triple parked. <laughs> I have... <laughs> oh my god, I need to cheers. Which, which, cheers. Two, what do I cheers with? Oh my god. Yay. Cheers. cheers. I am triple parked. Cheers. Sweet, sweet follower has just sent me a glass of champagne. I could cry, it's so sweet. I also have, <laughs> we have a rosé here. And then <laughs> Victoria has just ordered me a spicy <laughs> margarita. Is it good? It's really good. It's really good. Is it really good? I would say, I would say, for anyone that, that knows my spicy marg recipe, it could do with a tiny bit more spice, but generally it's really delicious. Lovely. Really lovely, right? Lovely. So, if my vlogging goes really, really, I mean, it's not been the best today. It's not been the best. If it goes further down the path, this is why. I lost my sunglasses on the boat. They we have a make your own ice cream station. This is so cute. Oh. I will take the acne for this because this is too fun. Oh, merci. So good. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Victoria. Good morning. Headed for breakfast, complete with mattress supplies. Sorry, it's, it's the last breakfast. This is so sad. Good morning. Am I the first so one? Cute. Yeah. It's just me. Yeah. Oh my god. I love that outfit. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm gonna miss this view so much. It's so stunning. We have just had breakfast and now we're off to play a bit of panel ten paddle tennis. Paddle tennis, I can't even say it. I'm wearing a cute outfit though, so you know it's gonna be a good workout when your outfit is cute. Back down the path and at the bottom, right at the very bottom, there is little tent, look, you can see it there. There's a tennis court. How fun! Oh my gosh, this is so fun. 